In Luke 11, the Savior teaches this very same passage, verbatim, quoted just as we have it here, but he pairs it with kind of a funny parable. Um, <laughs> he says, imagine that you are woken up in the middle of the night by someone pounding on your door, and it's your next door neighbor. And your next door neighbor says, quick, I've had some sudden guests who've shown up in the middle of the night, and I need something to feed them. Do you have any bread? And this is the situation, it's like midnight. And he says, imagine what you would do, you would roll over and get, say to your neighbor, no, leave me alone, it's the middle of the night, I'm trying to sleep. <laughs> but then the savior says, if that neighbor keeps knocking, you can't get back to sleep, and so you're gonna get up and you're gonna give him what he needs, even if it is midnight, 2 a.m. It's a very funny story. But right after telling that story, that's when he says, ask and it shall be given, seek and you shall find, knock and it shall be opened unto you. So right before he gives this passage, he gives us a parable where knocking plays a really central role. Mm -hmm. And there, knocking is not just a polite little tap at the door, hello, I would like to come inside. Knocking is a tenacious, kind of demanding, I'm not going away, holding on until you get the blessing that you need. And I think sometimes that's the kind of knocking that Heavenly Father wants to see from us. Knocking here, it's as much about the action of requesting, but I wonder if it also signifies the tenacity, the willingness to hang on and wrestle until you get a blessing in the way that Jacob talks about in Genesis. I had a recent experience on that going to the temple and there in the temple, I felt so strongly, you should ask. I know it is simple, but you should ask. I guess it's because it's a way of saying, I want to be closer to you. I want to hear a voice more frequently. And seeking and knocking is the doing, is acting in faith. The, the examples we might have in life is that, yeah, we ask for something that we need, material stuff. And then he gives us much, much more than what we need. And then it looks to me like he is saying, now what you're going to do with this? Right, right. Do something <laughs> better with what I'm giving you. Mm -hmm.